Hey, it's Richard with Presonus, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to send audio from a Studio Live Series 3 console to two stage boxes. One of the advantages of our stage boxes is that they offer two locking Ethernet ports, so you can daisy chain them. So in this exercise, I'm going to send the main left out to a stage right box, and I'm going to send the right out to a stage left box. Now another popular way of routing that audio guys like to do is to send a separate subwoofer out. They'll use an aux mix and put only what they want to go to the subwoofer into that aux. So we're going to do that as well. We're going to send aux 16 to an output on both of those boxes to control our subwoofer. Then we'll round it out with 12 aux mixes, 6 on one and 6 on the other. First I'm going to do it on the touch screen in the console and then we're going to do it through UC Surface. So, let's begin. All right, the first thing we're going to do is come to our audio routing, and then we're going to go to our stage box setup. Notice we have an 8.8 .8 and a 16.8. Let's just say the 8.8 .8 is our stage right box. It's going to be to our left. If I click it here, I can add that part of the name. So that's stage right, and I just did a rename. And then we're going to take the NSB 16.8 and call it stage left, enter. Now we know where they are on the stage. So a little trick about aux mixes. If I am on the stage right box, which is going to be the one on my left, if I go to sends 41 through 48, those automatically come from mixes 1 through 8 on my console. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on there. And then I'm going to apply, and notice this little box turned green. That says it's clocking, it's receiving audio. I'm going to go to my 16.8, which is going to be on the other side of the stage. And then I'm going to choose 49 through 56, which is going to automatically come from mixes 9 through 16. And again, when I hit apply, we're going to see that box. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our digital patching. Now, if I do AVB sends, remember we did 41 through 48 on the first box and 49 through 56 on the second box. So if I go AVB 41, notice that's already set to mix one. So mix one through eight is going to my stage right box, which is over on my left. And then if I go to AVB 49, notice that is nine through... Um, 16 coming going all the way to AVB 56 going to the one on the other side so all I'm going to do is we're going to choose output number 8 and that is going to be where we're going to go to each side so 48 I'm going to take as my available source mix main left and over here on 56 I'm going to make that my main Right. So now output number eight on my right box is mix output right and output eight on my left box is my left output. So we took mix 16 out of play. So now we're going to bring it back in and make it our subwoofer. So channel eight is already going to main left. So let's make channel 7, which is 47, and choose that to be mix 16. And then we'll come down here and go 55, which is going to be channel 7 on the right side, and make that mix 16. Notice I chose it on two different sends here, and it's able to go to both places at the same time. So now we have main left, main right, and now I've got a subwoofer going a subwoofer send going to both sides and you can see we already have six auxes mix 9 10 11 12 13 14 going there and we have mixes 1 through 6 going to the left box if i wanted to continue with mix 7 here all i'd have to do is go to avb 49 and change it to 7 AVB 50 and change it to 8, 51, change it to 9, 52, going to 10, 53, going to 11, 54, goes to 12. Now we have 12 aux sends going to 
one, two, three, four, five, six on the first box, one, two, three, four, five, six on the second box. We have left going to number eight on the left box, main mix right going to eight on the second box, and then we have mix 16 going as a subwoofer to both boxes at the same time. One of the advantages of the Studio Live Series 3 ecosystem is that the routing can be done on the console via the touchscreen like I just did, or it can be done in UC Surface using a Mac or PC or iOS or Android device. So let's go ahead and see how that's done. So here we are in UC Surface, and I went ahead and cleared all the settings so that we're starting again from scratch. So let's take a look. Go to Network, and there we have the 8.8 .8 and the 16.8. And remember, the 8.8 .8 was our stage right box. It's going to be the one on the left. And we pulled the output stream from 41 through 48. And I hit apply. And now we'll go to the 16.8. And remember, that was our stage left box. The output stream is coming from 49 through 56. And then I'll hit apply. And notice if I click that, there it is. If I click that one, there that is. You can see that it saved my changes. All right, let's move on to digital patching. So I'm going to click that there. AVB sends is where we're going to start. And remember, mixes 1 through 8 went to 41 through 48. And remember, 9 through 16 went to 49 through 56. Now, we changed... 56 to be mix right, main right, and we changed 48 to be main left, and then mix 16 we pulled from AVB 55, and we pulled it from AVB 47. There it is. Now we have mixes 1 through 6 going to the left channel and mixes um, 9 through tw uh, 14 going to the, the box on the stage left side, on our right side. And then what we did before, remember, we did mix um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then we just came here and changed mix 7 to go from 49 mix 8 to go from 50, and so forth. And now we have mixes 1 through 6 go into the left side, the stage right box, our left, and we have mixes 7 through 12 going to the stage left box, which is on our right. We have mix 16 going to channel 7 on both of the boxes, and we have the main left going to channel 8 on the stage right box and the main right going to channel 8 on the stage left box. And that's how it's done. We want to resource you in any way we can to help you learn and master the Studio Live Series 3 ecosystem. So please keep checking back for more tutorials, tips and tricks, and use cases to help you along the way. Thank you so much for using our products and thanks for watching. See you next time.